Morning, it's Laura T at Dream Deals 123 on eBay. I'm the Silver Owl Thrifter on YouTube, and I made $57 last night. Let's break it down and see how much is profit. It wasn't very much profit. Um, <coughs> all right. I sold this. Banana Republic, size large. Women's Banana Republic Chunky Knit Large Wool Blend Turtleneck Sweater Cream. And I sold this for $12 and $8 shipping. And I paid four for this, so I only made six on this. Um, I'm running a 40% off sale. I'm sending out offers. I'm taking offers. Um... You know, when you don't have any sales <laughs> and you get an offer, you just, I just take it. I'm like, I got to get something on the board here. So that was one of my bigger profit items. Uh, Life is good. Men's shirt, gray, 2XL, golf, handheld device, tee, cotton crusher. And a nice big size, very nice shape. I paid four for it and sold it for $10 and $7 shipping. So I made $6 on that. And this, um, I just took an offer because it's a coat and I really want to move my coats. If I don't sell them, they're just going to go to Goodwill. But this one, I didn't realize I, well, even if I had realized, I probably still would have sold it. I paid $9 for this. It's a, so I really paid up for this. Eddie Bauer Women's Black Premium Goose Down Quilted Puffer Zip Coat Medium. It's a puffer coat. It's chief goose down. It's medium. It's not bad. I, I don't know. You know, I think maybe I, a lady offered me $11, I think. $12 and I took it. And uh, plus was $8 shipping. So it was... 20 but then since i paid nine after shipping and fees i'm not making anything on this breaking even well i'm making my nine dollars back darn it right so there's that um that's better than the thrift store right uh so because i don't know if you know i've been donating to the thrift store and i don't think i get deductions anymore because we have such a high standard deduction now but we'll see Anyways, that's neither here nor there. So I made $57 gross, $12 net. You know, I only have about 300 and... How many listings do I have? You know, and that's something to think about when people say they make... They're selling a lot. Um, I know, I mean, when I had 2,200 listings, I was selling every day. Um but I got rid of a lot of stuff because I'm moving. And a lot of it wasn't selling. And it's like, uh, but uh, definitely had more sales than I'm having today. I'm sorry, I'm kind of rambling here. What am I looking for? I'm looking for how many listings do I have active right now? Probably like 316. Cause it was, yeah, 315. So sold three. What's that? 1%. So it's all right. Uh, I'm making steady sales. I'm today. What are we doing today? Well, I have to go to the, um, oh, well, let me just do this here. I've made 57 gross for 37,734 gross this year. $12 net for 16,378. Gosh, I'm just at a pretty much 50% margins exactly for the year, which isn't bad. Um, Chelsea has to go to the vet this afternoon, not because of her collapsed trachea, which is an issue she has where she uh, is coughing and, and stuff, but she's okay with that. It's just got to be managed. This is what happened. Let's see, yesterday, day before yesterday. I was in the kitchen and uh, Chelsea and Bingley were down in the basement and I hear Chelsea coming upstairs and I hear a yelp, kind of like a hurt yelp and then a kind of a rant from a cat and I don't know what happened I don't know if the cat I, I really don't know what happened but that evening we noticed Chelsea had a limp no no the next morning yesterday morning we noticed she had a 
a limp. She's definitely favoring it, doesn't want to jump up on anything, her right rear leg. So I don't know if she fell down the stairs. Um, I don't know if the cat got her because she won't really let me get too near it. I mean, I've kind of touched it. She's putting weight on it, so I don't think it broke. Um, but we're going to go get that checked out, and I will give you an update on that. Um, all the cabinets are off in the kitchen. We're having them painted out side in the garage. It's got a very interesting way to paint these cabinet covers. If you ever want to spruce up your kitchen, by the way, and you have cabinets, but you just maybe don't like their colors, look into getting them painted. Um, it just can make things look so nice. We're having them painted because um, we're selling the house, of course, and everywhere where you had a handle was like worn off to the wood because somebody they were wood and somebody painted them white and now we're repainting them white. But anyways, it's just very interesting. But all the cabinets are off in the kitchen and boy, does it look crazy in there. But I like it because you don't have to open anything. You just reach, throw in, you can see everything. It's very handy. It looks terrible. Uh, <laughs> what are we doing? Um, ba -ba -ba. We're watching Beckham on Netflix. My husband is absolutely crazy about soccer. He grew up in Turkey. And, you know, soccer or football, as it's called in other countries, is extremely po more popular. Always has been. My husband uh, loves it. So we've been watching Beckham. It's good. Um, one thing I wanted to say was when I, and I mentioned this before, like when I sing songs, I'm sorry I don't always um, tell who's it's from. I just, I forget. I want to do like a playlist or something of all the songs I like. Maybe we can share songs we like. Share some of your favorite songs in the comments. I'm always looking for good music to listen to. I have a hard time listening to new music because it's like everything that I play disappoints me a little bit. <laughs> Send me some stuff. Andrea, my sister. Hello, Andrea, if you're watching. You always have good songs. And uh, that is about it. I'm going to go going to go to the thrift store and drop some stuff off today and maybe wander in there for a minute and uh, I need some new joggers. Um, I was just for fun looking at how much joggers are on the internet. Like if I was going to buy them on the internet, what I would do is put in joggers women's large cheapest. And so I was looking, I mean, uh, you can get a lot of joggers for under $10 shipped. So this is competition people. This is what people are doing. Um, so I don't know. I don't know. Uh, I, I, it, it's very competitive. That's all I'll say. So you got to get it at a good price. Like if I hadn't paid $9 for that, I would have made $9. Um, and then the life is good. I paid four and the sweater I paid for, which doesn't seem like a lot, but boy, when you're, uh, when you're not getting much, many offers and things. Anyways, uh, well, what time is it? Yeah, I better go and I better get going on stuff. And I hope everybody is doing well. I'm sorry, I keep looking over there. Um, not a lot to say, but I just did want, I'm gonna try to at least uh, every time I have some sales come on so we can at least talk about that. Um, yeah, my son, oh, my son is coming into town tomorrow and he's got a jujitsu tournament that he's doing in Atlantic City. So he's flying here into BWI, just gonna spend the night, drive out there, come back, spend another night, come back, but it'll be really, really nice to see him. And uh, if anybody likes jujitsu, he's got a jujitsu podcast, uh, jujitsu outlet. And uh, he's doing lots of interesting things with jujitsu. He just opened up a club and uh, He's doing kind of like private jujitsu weekends for like people and stuff. It's all very exciting. So anyways, I'm excited to see him and talk to him about all his endeavors. And I'll see you in the next one.